got done shopping at Walmart. Oh, I just want to pop in and say, hey, I'm going to smoke a cigarette. I've been vaping most of the time. Not that I have to explain myself. I saw it anyway. Um, Dad has got an infection and he's loopy and he's home. Um, we have to take him to the doctor tomorrow. We had to take him to the urologist Friday. That was very hectic because he can't really stand up straight. I'm going to turn this heat down. Sorry about that. So anyway, um, that's what I'm dealing with. And Debbie's at home with him right now. And tomorrow we have to take him to his regular physician, which his physician is busy. So we have to see the nurse practitioner. So we'll see. what David and um, Josh are going to help get him there. Hopefully we can get him into the car and get him out of the car and back into the car. I'm telling you. It's just terrible and that sun is bright. It is a whopping 22 degrees and the wind is blowing and it is flipping really, really cold. It feels like 14 degrees. So, and um, I found a couple shirts at Walmart for $5. And I found a little T-strap shirt to wear underneath my shirts um, for $2.98. So, I'm happy about that. My uh, brakes are grinding. I need to get new brakes. Good gracious, my car is filthy dirty. My windshield is filthy dirty, and it's so cold that my windshield wiper stuff won't work. Oh, my brakes sound terrible. David's boyfriend can, he works on cars. I was hoping maybe to get my brakes done this weekend, but that didn't happen. I don't think David told him that I needed him to do my brakes. Which it's very, very cold. And David would have to try to see if he could take the car up to his dad's. He has a garage. I have a garage too, but I can't get in there because David's stuff's in there, so. I'm hungry, I'm not feeling well, I'm stressed, I'm tired, uh, dad got me up at 7.30 this morning wanting to get up out of bed, his back was hurting, these cars need to come on and get on with it. Um, I'm grumpy, sorry, I'm not spreading much sunshine today, not much sunshine at all, dang buddy, I can't freaking go because he's freaking cars oh I hate it when people do that to me rush me stupid jerk young kids well I guess I might as well stay in that lane and get on the expressway and go up there anyway I'm not very happy and it's been very very cold Everybody staying warm and safe and oh, it was on my face. That's just great. Walking around with something on my face at Walmart. I didn't have my pajamas on though. I was not in my Walmart attire. I should have worn my pajamas. So anyway, what are you guys up to this weekend? Today's Sunday. I had to think about what day it was. So anyway, that's what I'm doing. It's um, going on 5 o'clock. I got some soup beans on the stove. I bought some cornbread at Walmart. Bought another thing of yarn. I'm trying to make those uh, fingerless mittens. Um, I made one with a skein of yarn. And then I had to buy another yarn. Get it off there and I had it messed 
up. And I couldn't figure out how to get those pieces back on there right. So I just took it all apart and rolled up my yarn. Sideways, it didn't wouldn't do right, Mr. Do right. So anyway, I'm gonna go home and I don't know what I'm gonna do. I made some chicken salad. I'm trying to make protein stuff for my dad. Um, we're gonna have to wash him off and give him a bed bath tonight for the doctors tomorrow if we can get him there. He goes to the VA doctor um, Thursday. We're going to try to get some help through the VA. Uh, but he hasn't been to the doctor in a year, so. Oh, my brakes sound terrible. I would love to go see that Underworld movie, the new one that's out. But I don't have anybody to go with. And I don't really want to go to the movies by myself. I don't know. I'm getting pretty desperate. My sister told me to get out and go do something. And I couldn't find anybody to do anything with, so here I am. I went to Walmart, and I'm going back home. I'd love to go see that movie, but like I said, I don't have anybody to go see it with, so. And nobody that I know watches the, uh, has watched the Underworld movies, the Lycans. Gosh, that sun's bright. Sun shines bright on my old Kentucky home. Serenade you. Oh, well. I guess that's about it. I've been watching some videos. Not a lot. I've been watching my dad, and he is sleeping and talking out of his head. And while he's sleeping, he's doing things with his hands, and he's talking to somebody, and I don't know, and he's talking in this different tone. He has this different voice he's using and that's weird and and it's because he's sick he's got this um urinary tract infection and then they've got this catheter in him again and that creates problems can create problems so i don't know so if you pray or send out good wishes and healthy seat healing wishes please send them his way and mine and debbie's way because we for strength and patience to get through this and to figure out what we're going to do. If he can't get his legs back, I'm telling you, I don't know what we're going to do. I, I can't take care of him. He's just too big for me. Um, he's, his stomach is swollen. He is eating better. Um, I've been, my diabetes is doing good. Um, I haven't done any videos because I just just I'm sorry everybody I just really am not with it and not into it and I don't really have anything to talk about or you know except for him and you know people get tired of that I don't have anything fun to talk about so all right I guess I'll end this because I'm almost home so um I'm going 51 and a 45 and that little flash of things flashing its blue lights red and blue lights at me so, I hope everybody's well and doing good and make me some videos I can get on there and watch. I saw it, Cheryl Coyote, she has fallen and done a few things and isn't feeling well. So, Cheryl, I, if you watch this, I hope you're feeling better and you're doing good. And Marty, I'm praying for your mom and you and your family and I'm praying for everybody actually. And hey, Lala, how are you? And Lisa Rose and Diane and Diane and... Oh, Stephanie and Joanne and everybody and Tracy B and Lynn B and I hope everybody's doing good. Elizabeth in Texas, how you doing? And then we got um, is it Glenda that's in Australia that watches? Hey everybody, thanks so much for your love and support. I so, so, so appreciate each and every one of you. 
all the love and support that I'm getting and the prayers is awesome. Thank you, thank you so much. Um, so I guess that's it because I'm getting ready to turn into the road, everybody. Like I said, stay warm. I'm sending love and prayers for all of you. And I appreciate each and every one of you. Thanks for stopping by and riding home with me. We didn't ride two today, but we rode home. So I just want to pop in here and give you a little update on how miserable life is at the McKinney house. And we're going nuts and we're praying and worried and confused. And so thanks again. Please subscribe and hopefully things will look up for us and um, get better and um, work out and you know I haven't got to go work out but um, subscribe leave me a comment down below and let me know what you're up to I sure do appreciate you and love to come and love to talk back with you and listen and read to see what you're up to and um, thanks a lot and uh, hey don't forget to spread a little sunshine all right, I'll talk to you later. Bye.